and welcome to our lesson on angles in a quadrilateral. So to begin with, we're going to understand why the angles in a quadrilateral add up to 360 degrees. So we have a quadrilateral here, and you can see we can split this up into two triangles, and angles in a triangle add up to 180. So because we have two lots of 180, we have 360 degrees in total. And it works for any quadrilateral where we can split it up into two lots of 180. So again, we have another 360. So angled in a quadrilateral A, B, C, and D, the sum of A, B, C, and D is equal to 360 degrees. We're going to apply this fact to calculate angle A. Well, we know all four angles add up to make 360. So the 70 plus the 65 plus the 80 degree angle and angle A add up to 360. We can add these three angles together, which is 215 plus angle A equals 360. So angle A will equal 360 minus 215, which is equal to 145 degrees. The question B, we've been asked to work out this angle, but to do that, we need to work out this angle first. Well, we know that angles on a straight line add up to 180, so this angle will be 180, take away the angle on the straight line, which is 80, then this will be 100 degrees. So we can work out angle B, which will be 360, take away the other three angles. And this is 62 degrees. So angle B is 62 degrees. Okay, let's try some more questions. So do you want to try and work out the value of angle C and angle D by pausing the video and you can resume it when you're ready. Okay, for angle C. We know these angles means near each 90 degrees. And all four angles will add up to make 360. So we have 90 at 90, which is 180. Plus the 120 plus angle C will equal 360. 120 at 180 is 300, plus angle C will equal 360. So angle C must be equal to 60 degrees. To work out angle D, we need to work out this angle first. And this will be the difference between the 360 and the other three angles. So 360, take away the 105, take away the 95, take away the 85. So this angle here will be 75 degrees. And we know it lies on a straight line with angle D. So angle D is going to be 180, take away the 75, angle D will be 105 degrees. Okay, thank you very much for watching. I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care.